Welcome to a Loot Crate unboxing for March. Yes, March, April, March, March, 2016. Yeah, it's March. Okay, again, I never know what the month is. I'm trying to uh, remove my knife so I can unbox the thing, but I can't see what I'm doing because I'm paying attention to figuring out which date it is today. Anyway, yes, it's March apparently. So I don't know what the theme is. It's a theme. We'll find out. Okay, I'm gonna actually put the box over here for once. Because I have more room now. Because I just rearranged stuff. Uh, let's see if I can find the uh, thing that tells me what the thing is. Theme. Uh, you know what? I have no idea what the theme is. We're just gonna jump straight in. Um, immediately I find some alien versus predator stuff, which makes me think it could be like space or aliens. Um, I've never watched Alien vs. Predator. Sorry to disappoint all of you. Uh, but there is an Alien vs. Predator. It's like a... It's a pop. It's one of those pop figure things. I don't know who we're going to get, but there's the characters you can get. Let's find out who we got. It won't be any of the good ones. Oh, this box isn't resealable. So they know if you've opened it. Well, it's quite a big, chunky thing, whatever it is. Watch, by the way, watch me get this like crappy looking thing on the floor there. Yeah, I better, I better get that. No, I didn't. <gasps> I got like the best one. In my opinion, the best one. I mean, I haven't seen the film, but the best one. <gasps> it's the alien thing. It's the big alien thing with the cool head. Anyway, the head twists. You can turn the head. Um, that is the extent. Oh, you can move his arms as well. Whee! He seems far too smiley. I imagine he's probably supposed to be more angry and terrifying. But he seems far too smiley. He's got sort of vents coming out the back of his back. Anyone who's seen the film will understand. But I do not because I haven't seen the film. But there's a cool thing. And he does stuff. Well, he doesn't. He just sort of stands there. He's got cool moving arms and stuff. Yeah, so that's that. It's, one, it's just another, another figure that can go on my shelf. Anyway, standard rules. Goes on the floor. I don't have that much room. I just have some room. Uh, good. So that can go in there. Sorry to headphone viewers for the scrunching sound. Okay. As promised, a t-shirt in every box this year. So we have a t-shirt. It is Star Trek related, which I have very little knowledge of the Star Trek universe. I know some of it. Not much. Um, but yeah, there's a Star Trek... Uh, it's supposed to be Spock and whatever the other guy's name is. Sorry. Sorry, Trekkies. I don't know the name. But there you go. So it's Spock and the other guy. It's quite a nice t-shirt. I mean, if you're going to walk around with a... Um, is that Len... Is it supposed to be Leonard? Spock and Leonard? Is that supposed to be what it's supposed to be? Oh, I don't know. Um, yeah, if you... If you walk around in a Star Trek t-shirt, you can probably guarantee... Well, they actually have, like, loot crate things now. Guarantee that uh, people are going to give you some form of weird look. But yeah, I mean, you know, to the trackies out there, they'll love that. Oh, yes. Let me just, uh... Okay, so, I'm assuming the this stands for Daredevil, obviously. It's a, it's Daredevil merch. It's a, it's a beanie. It's a Daredevil beanie. Not Daredevil. Deb... No. It is Daredevil. Yeah, I'm right. It's Daredevil. You know, the, the blind guy who saves people. You watch him on Netflix. He has a film. And there's stuff. And it's cool. It's a hat. It's got a thing on it. Oh, it says reversible. So you can turn... Oh! So you can either have the Daredevil symbol, or you can turn it inside out and have an evil skull. So you can have red, or you can have black. Depends on how you're feeling for the current day. So there you go. It's reversible to have different things. It's got a Marvel thing on it. But obviously you remove that when you want to wear it. That's kind of the point. I'm going to remove this massive reversible sticker. And I'm going to remove the uh, the Loot Crate logo sticker. Why they decided to put stickers all over this, I will never know. And I will remove the tag. Because I have no intention of selling this. So... I have no intention of keeping the tag. Okay, the plastic thing that's supposed to come out has probably gone inside the thing somewhere. But you know what? That's what you get. One size fits most. It's most. Most. If you've got a massive head, it won't fit you. I'm saying. One size fits most. Made in China. For ages 14 and older. What is a... 
Sorry, is a 13 year old not going to be able to wear this? Just saying. Oh, it's got like, yeah, okay, cool. Yeah, my camera's inverted, so. Ah, oh, you can kind of feel that skull on the inside there. It's not the most comfortable thing in the world. I mean, like the hat is, but the skull is not. Okay, well, there you go. I essentially look like I've got a fucking Johnny on my head. But, there you go. That's, uh, that's what I'm wearing, so. I'm going to wear that for the rest of the video. Cool. Back on the floor. We have the badge. The wonderful badge. Of which that you get given stuff now. So, there you go. The ba Oh, the theme is versus, by the way. The badge is there. You can take it out of the packet if you really care. It's a badge, people. It's made of metal. And if you go to the website on the back and you have a Loot Crate account and you log in, it gives you something each month. I don't know what this month is. It'll give me something. Last, It's normally a comic book or something. Like a digital download of a comic book. It's never been... So far, it hasn't been anything good. But, I mean, we are only in the third month of them doing this. So, you never know. Let's put that back in the packet. What do you have here? Um, Superman versus Batman, I'm assuming. Looks Superman versus Batman y. Oh, it's another one of these paper wallets. You know, we got the uh, the Simpsons one. The one like a few a few long times ago. We got the Simpsons paper wallet. Well, this is the uh, Superman Batman one. There you go, you can see the uh, Superman Batman theme. And uh, on the inside, there's some sort of crappy bits of paper. I'm not sure this is real money. Just saying. They didn't... I'll just cut this out. This uh, random ice cream man is such a shot. My bad. One second. Sorry about that. Hopefully he's, uh, he's not going to make too much noise now. I have closed my window. Um, yeah, first time I decided to record this. And uh, first time in about a year that the ice cream man is such a shot. So, there you go. Anyway, I'm sure some children enjoyed his ice cream. Um, but yeah, so they get that wallet. Um, it does actually, and this made me laugh, have a card in it that says, Do you dare to tear? And you've got to put, you're supposed to post the video on YouTube if you uh, want to tear this. Honestly, I don't think this is that strong. I don't want to tear it because I like it. Well, I'm never going to use it, but I like it. Um, but I could probably tear this piece pretty easily. This doesn't seem difficult. I mean, unless there's something I'm missing here, if I applied a slight amount of strength to this, it feels like it would literally just break. Hmm. Maybe. I don't know. Well, they, they, they claim it's very hard to tear it anyway. So there you go. Throw that down there. What's next? Word Gush. The game for your mobile. And, uh, apparently it's free to download and play. Um, yeah, just, I'm not getting anything with this. This is just an advert for a game. So, you pay, let me, let me get this straight. Loot Crate have never advertised at me before. They've, you know, they've included stuff that belongs to companies. But they've, they've never, like Marvel hats and whatever. But they've, uh, they've never directly advertised at the customer with something that you don't pay for doesn't cost anything, and is literally just an advert. That's what this is, Loot Crate. Um, please stop. Don't do this again. This is actually legitimately, and it just tells you it's free on the back there. It's legitimately just a free game ad. Like, they're advertising a mobile game. Why? You've spent the money people pay you for these boxes on getting this shit. Don't send me that again. Ever. Thank you. Rant over. Uh, we have a uh, number one issue uh, DC Comics thing. I think, it, is it actually a comic book or is it just the front of a comic book? No, it's actually a comic book. It's got a Loot Crate custom cover on it. It says Harley Quinn. But, um, yeah, it's, uh, it's just a, it's a comic book. I don't really like comic books. I mean, no, some people do. I'm not a massive comic book person. We have here, oh, the book, of course. The book. Is that it? Are we done? We are done. Let's say, uh, yeah, there's the, we can, we can see what's in the mega crate today. Um. Oh, it does it tell me. Okay, so, um. 
The, uh, the, 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 what am I reading here? Oh, okay. So, uh, if you are a, the, the pin, the badge, in case you're wondering what it gets you this month. If you're inside the US, you can get a choice of film. Uh, either, um, Aliens or Predator. It's up to you. Alien or Aliens or Predator. Or if you're outside the US, you get uh, an extra comic book, a digital comic book download. Kind of bollocks, um, because I would rather have the movie than the comic book. As I've told you, I don't particularly care for comic books. And I told you I also haven't seen Alien, so that would have been good for me to watch. Oh well. So there you go, that's uh, the Luke Ray unboxing for March. Uh, Luke Ray never advertise me again, because I will literally unsubscribe in seconds if you do. That's a terrible thing to do. Please stop wasting people's money. Um, and uh, yeah, so if you want to get yourself a loot crate and you feel like blowing 20 bucks a month, whatever it is, there's a link below in uh, in the description there for a referral link. And uh, yeah, it's all right. It wasn't a bad month. I mean, there's a Star Trek t-shirt I don't really care for. The alien figurine, I've never seen alien, so it doesn't bother me. The wallet, um, it's crap. I'm never going to use it. Seriously, who's going to use a paper wallet? We all have leather wallets. Or no wallet at all. And you just use your pocket. Um, and the magazine... Oh, the comic book, Marvel... Uh, DC Comics book, I don't care for. Basically, I don't care for much of this crate. Like, oh, the hat. The hat's cool. I'll wear the hat. I like Daredevil. It's a good hat. Or, but the skull on the inside. Be, being reversible is good, but uh, don't make the thing you're reversing into like 3D because this is like actually in my head. Although I can't refill really it after a while. It numbs out. But yeah, thank you for watching and I'll uh, I'll catch you all soon. Sorry about the ice cream man as well. Peace out.